there will be greater transparency. Sabi nga ni Secretary Aguda sa akin, kung may implement to first of its kind in the world na gagamitin sa isang government agency tulad ng DPWH at ng DBM, I think this is a very, very important step. Itong paggamit ng blockchain no? at paggamit ng teknolohiya para mabantayan each and every step of the process sa buong departamento, mula central office, down to the regional office, down to the district office. The blockchain bill is actually sharing the data to the public. Yes, and it has to be permissionless, Mr. Chair, if, if, if I'm going to decide on this. It's because if you do permissionless data, anyone can just access it. Academia can access it, citizen can access it, etc. And with regards to the budget uh, or the, the, the flow of, of systems, that what I've, I've seen, or would you have a problem with the budget, is that what you do is that the asset, like for example the contract, the GAA, whatever that uh, information is, you use it as a control to flow the uh, digital asset. It could be a token, no? And you use the token to actually ramp it out as a proof to get the actual money from the bank. So if the if the uh, inspection is not yet submitted, then of course the tokens cannot be released and therefore cannot be ramped off to the bank. That could be a control, Mr. Chair.